Last weekend, I mentioned I was washing my sheets because I try and do that once a week. Towels, on the other hand, you want to wash every three times you use them or at least once a week because a moist towel can really harbor a lot of microbes that actually can contribute to skin problems, acne breakouts. Now, if you have a skin infection like ringworm, you're gonna wanna wash after every use. Don't share your towels because they can definitely transfer the, those microorganisms, not only to other parts of your body, but then of course to other people. Ringworm in particular, it makes these little spores, they're very hardy, and the bathroom is a place where it sort of thrives because of the moisture especially. Uh, so make sure that if you have that, you are really being on top of your cleaning game and keeping your tub and bathroom floor really clean, sanitizing them regularly because they can really facilitate just the lingering of that little fungus and ultimately it can end up getting on other parts of your body. People who have athlete's foot can easily transfer the athlete's foot to the groin area just by pulling up their underwear. Uh, so we tell people who have athlete's foot to actually put their socks on before their underwear because the action of dragging the underwear up over the bare feet with the athlete's foot can lead to jock itch and then you ultimately can spread it to your hand as well. Get ringworm on your hand. Ringworm, jock itch, athlete's foot, they're all common names for a fungal infection, tinium. I'm gonna come in with the Vertio UV Moisture Gel. I really enjoy this as a face and body sunscreen. It's water resistant. I have a few sunscreens here that I'm rotating through at the Momento. The Color Science Face Shield Flex. The Beauty of Yost Joseon one. Surprise, surprise, it's raining again today. <laughs> Tonight, I think I'm gonna try and go to that light show that I didn't get to go to last weekend because it got rained out. Oh, the other sunscreen that I've been using a lot, Hot Labo UV White Gel. This is great. I went ahead and fired up the Let It Flow, Let It Flow Pinot candle from this set that I got in my FabFitFun box. And I put it in this canister that I got as like a gift set a few years ago. And it looks really pretty. The scent is very mild like it doesn't have much of a throw it looks so pretty in the jar that's my coffee we have a new coffee flavor from none other than raven's brew but i decided to try this double dead so watch out because i think it has extra caffeine which i didn't realize when i purchased it all right let's give her a taste tastes amazing how did they get it to have extra caffeine like do they just breed the beans that way Weird, aldi Check out this bed tray. It's cute. It's like you can use to store stuff on. Here's a little electric kettle. It's not nearly as cute as my Kasori one though. Mini pie molds. Those are adorable. Seems like too big of a chunk that they're taking out though. Does that automatically cut them or that's just how I did for the image? This is nice for a baker. It's a silicone mat and then the two spatulas and a sweet little tree ornament. These are nice baking molds and a tree. What else do they have? And then this one, how sweet is that? It's like Santa on a going down the chimney. I wonder how well it actually looks when you, I wonder how it looks when you actually pop it out and it looks that nice. Ooh, check this out. Little on the go storage containers for your lunchbox. The little dips and stuff, sauces. Oh, it's the gnome. That's cute, a little LED house. These are always so cute, but they pick up like a lot of hair and lint and stuff. And if you live in a dry climate, they're like a static palooza. We have a little indoor lit tree, birch tree, LED. And they have these little houses that light up. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. It'd be cute for a desk. Nostalgic gnome. Looks more like Santa. We also have a mini tree. Oh, this is nice. It's to hang the stockings and it has a countdown and it lights up. Oh, those are sweet. Mr. and Mrs. Claus mugs. Man, Aldi has good Christmas decorations in this year. All right, so let's go ahead and crack into the Yes Style and Style Vana Advent calendars. 
I love opening these. So today I'm gonna do the first two days of both and then tomorrow, which will be Sunday when you're watching this, you'll see day three and day four. Let's start out with Yes Style. Day one, we have Better Than Cheek. All right, that's pretty. It's a cheek color. All right. Last year I got, what did I get from this brand that I used a lot? A brow pencil, I loved it. So this brand is actually pretty good. Rom and ND, Rom and ND. So this is their Better Than Cheek. Here we go with day two. Ugh. Day two is from Isntree, their Chestnut AHA 8% Clear Essence. I have no idea what's in this because it didn't come with any sort of packaging but I do look forward to giving it a try. Isn't Tree has quite a few really good products. I really like this brand. I love their sunscreens. They have a clay mask that's really good and some moisturizers. All right, let's get into Stylevana here. Where is day one? There it is, the golden box. Although the drawer is kind of difficult to get into. Okay, finally got it. What do we have here? This is Madagascar Centella Hialu Sika Blue. Hi Madagascar Centella Hialu Sika Blue Serum with Pure Centella. I've tried a few things from Skin 1004. I like their sunscreen. All right, so this has Centella Leaf Water. It has niacinamide, which you guys know is helpful for redness and hyperpigmentation. It has polyglutamic acid. That's good for moisturizing. It does have rose flower water, so if you're allergic to fragrance, this would not be for you because that could potentially cross-react. It has ceramides, hydrolyzed hyaluronic acid, hyaluronic acid, panthenol. I look forward to giving this a try. Let's check out the texture. All right, it's a pump packaging and it's a nice, lightweight hydrating consistency and over here we have day two looks like we got more than one thing in day two we have peak. oh these always look so enticing this frutia brand i think it's all scented but the little packaging is super adorable what is it a hydrating blueberry intensive cream and a blueberry hydrating cream, all right. They both have fragrance, bummer. So scented moisturizers, let's check them out though. I'm gonna take them out of the packaging. Aren't the little jars sweet? So they, uh, they screw open. This one's like a hydrating gel. And then this one is more of a cream. Looks like little jars. Okay. All right, come back tomorrow and we'll check out day three and day four. I'm here in Sugarland. Look at this light display. I had tickets for last weekend, but it was raining. Got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light. I am right where I wanna be. I'll be home for a couple of days. Wander around with you, you and me in the cold. Thought it'd never be true. Wherever I go, I got you. Oh, I have stopped running, there is no way trying You better loosen your belts Drinking hot wine by the fire Don't care of anything else It's Christmas And some kind of love, my friend I pray it will never end Do you like to be here too? It's Christmas And outside snow's glistening It's just you and me tonight I'll spend all this Christmas with you Oh, it's 
such a charm, got you up in my arm. There's nobody at the door. You said I wish this will never be over, darling. It's time for your present. Come over here now. It is time to get out in the snow, lighting a light with you. Choirs will sing and the joy bells will ring. Nobody loves you as much as I do. It's a wonderful feeling from floor to the ceiling. It is that time of the year. Drinking hot wine by the fire. Here on our own, we got nothing to fear. It's Christmas and some kind of love, my friend. Pick up some candy canes and hang a wreath on your door. It's Christmas and outside snow's glistening. It's just you and me tonight. It's just you and me tonight. It's just you and me tonight. I'll spend all this Christmas with you. shower finish my skincare routine hey if you were looking for a reason not to drink alcohol today here's your friendly reminder it's not good for your health um, I was reading some articles reminding myself of papers that came out this year but it's really a toxin it's actually toxic and I feel like my entire life or childhood adolescence I was always warned about drugs and how bad they are and they are um, but I feel as though the adverse effects of alcohol were seriously downplayed, hush-hush, swept under the rug. I think for a long time it got a free pass. Like, alcohol consumption, including red or white wine, it's associated with a significantly increased risk for a ton of cancers. Mouth, throat, voice box, esophagus, colon, rectum, liver, and breast cancer. Not to mention, um, it's not good for your heart. It is a toxin. Uh, the metabolite, the breakdown product of alcohol is acetaldehyde and it is a toxin. I mean, it damages the DNA in your body and that's what sets the stage for cancers as well as a variety of other health problems. And it's also photosensitizing, you know, drinking alcohol in the sun, it is really no bueno. So yeah, if you were looking for a reason not to drink alcohol, I'm here. Look, I know a lot of you guys enjoy your drinks in moderation. You don't overdo it. It's something you enjoy. And I'm not here to rain on your parade for that. I'm merely here because I feel like society as a whole is blindly unaware of how bad alcohol can be for your health. And they focus on other things that are not really proven to be harmful for human health, like, you know, parabens in a skincare product. You know, they will laser focus on that, and I feel like the risks with alcohol are seriously underplayed. Wow, I don't know where this all came from. I guess because I was reading that paper. All that to say, thank you guys for coming along with me today. What did I put on my face? A moisturizer um, and my tretinoin I already put on. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and the opening of the K-Beauty Advent Calendar. Get excited for December because we're opening that during the weekend vlogs and I always enjoy it. You guys humor me. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and as always, don't forget, sunscreen and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye!